Here we have a typical gum disease again with uh, the presence of uh, white cell, bacteria, mobile, very mobile bacteria, and long filament that act like a brush, uh, actinomyces. So uh, there we see a lot of uh, activity when the disease is going on, when the disease, uh, gum disease is very active and uh, then um, destroy the bone structure around the teeth. So now we see uh, many uh, amoeba present uh, that are um, feeding or finishing like this one. It has just finished feeding on a nucleus of white cell. It's going around uh, some more into the, the pus, uh, mix of pus, uh, white cell, bacteria, motile bacteria. So this is very active, and this is where you uh, lose, uh, might lose some uh, bone around the, your teeth. So we still see many uh, filaments. Uh, here in the middle, uh, an active um, amoeba feeding on the nucleus of a white cell. On top left, a baby amoeba just beginning its life and some uh, white cells, some have lost their uh, nucleus, so it has been eaten by the amoeba. One more amoeba here, two or three here, a little one. Now the amoeba, they live around those uh, long filaments, see the activity, long filament, the amoeba are nesting into this uh, biofilm just at the end of your uh, gum uh, sulcus and it uh, produce some uh, disease. You see baby one, you see the activity of the brushing filament, actinomyces, and how the inquilinism of the amoeba, uh, they are living with, the, literally living into this uh, brush pattern of uh, bacteria. This has been shown a lot of time by uh, caes, uh, lions, and cofoid, and we see the uh, very uh, eff effective activity. You see the amoeba here in the center finishing his uh, phagocytose of the nucleus with a fairly smaller amoeba just uh, beside and under. See how much activity there is. So uh, there's no point in uh, keeping those uh, animal parasites into the gum if you have the disease. Uh, surgery might be possible, but we, uh, we think it's uh, better to remove the infection, remove the amoeba, remove the bacteria, remove the leukocyte so that you can find a normal flora. So ask your dentist uh, to look at the microscope, your biofilm. It's very easy using a little bit of saliva and then taking uh, microbiota from uh, your gum uh, at the end of where, where is the problem. So we lastly see the amoeba going through uh, uh, leukocyte to proceed to next uh, feeding. So don't keep those animals into your, your gum if you want help.